Okay, so coming to CSAR first two. How to do CSAR first two? Okay, if this is the original cone, from the original cone, if you cut off a small cone, whatever is left is called as first two. Okay, this is bigger, this is smaller, this is big H, this is height of small cone, this is length of big cone, this is length of small cone. Okay, as this triangle is similar to this triangle, we can write CPST. What is the CPST? We can write small l by big l, small r by big r, small h by big h. CPST, it's corresponding parts of similar triangle. This triangle and this triangle are similar. Why? Because this is parallel, we will cut anyway, we will cut parallelly. This angle, this angle equal, this angle, this angle equal. Okay, so how do you find out? I am showing you CSA of frustum. How to find CSA of frustum means CSA of big cone minus CSA of CSA of small cone. Okay. CSA of big cone is pi big r big l minus pi small r small l. Pi if you take common, big r big l minus small r small l. Okay. Pi big r big l minus small r. The small l I will write it as L R by R. L R by R. Write it out. Concentrate. Pi. RL minus LR square by big R. LL take common. So pi L, if you take common, R minus R square by R. Okay. Pi L, R if you take common, R LC, R square minus R square. Okay. Pi L, A plus B into A minus B by R. Okay. Now what is it? Pi big L. So, R plus R, I will keep like this only because anyway it is in the formula. R minus R by R. I can give this R to anyone. I can give this R to any one of them. Okay. So, pi L, big R plus small R. This I will split. R by R minus small R by big R. Pi L, big R plus small R into 1 minus big, small R by big R. I can write as small L by big L also. Why you are writing like that means to cancel L. Pi L big R plus small r into L minus L by L. L L gets cancelled. L L gets cancelled. So final answer is pi big R plus small r big L minus from big L. If you remove small L, what is left over? Length of first term. So length of first term. This is the formula for CSA. If F is not there, just like F for your understanding. This is CSA of first term. Children, once you know CSA of first term, you can write TSA of first term also. Once you know CSA of first term, you can write TSA of first term also in writing. TSA of first term means what? This is CSA. This is small base. This is big base. TSA plus upper base plus down base. Okay. CSA of first term, how much we got? Pi L big R plus small r plus. Upper base is pi r square. Upper base is pi r square. Upper base is pi r square. And down base is pi big r square. Down base is what? Pi big r square. Pi big r square. So this is the formula for TSA. TSA will have pi take common L r plus r plus small r square plus big r square. Okay. So anyway, TSA will come. TSA means CSA plus small base plus big base. TSA means CSA plus small base plus big base. The only CSA means CSA of first term is pi L big R plus small R. Pi L big L big R plus small R. Where L is called length of the first term. M is called length of the first term. This is the derivation for CSA of first term. Okay. All of you please copy down. 10 seconds I'm giving time. After giving time you can ask me doubts. Please copy down. TSA plus upper base plus down base gives you TSA. TSA of the first term. Small triangle is similar to big triangle. Big triangle. Small triangle is similar to big triangle. So I took similarity. Small L by big L, small R by big L, small S by big H. Once I explain triangles, you will understand what is similarity. Don't worry about that. 